Hey folks, Fat Guy Flies RC out here at the Avon Park Air Boss Club. Hi. We're going to do the maiden on my second refall. The first refall ripped the gear out of it, ripped the belly up, and by the time I was buying parts and everything and the way I was repairing it, I just said, no, this is a promotional plane, so I just bought myself another one. Right, left, up, down, right, left. However, I have bypassed the circuit board and I do not have that crow configuration for flaps, but this plane fly, slows down just fine by with a high alpha type landing. So, right, left, up, down. All right, enough stalling. Three and a half minutes, 4,300 roaring top. Got the KN afterburner in there. It goes blue, uh, blue at 50 and and purple at 100 so oh here we go oh hold on something's itching on my head don't have kind of try to negate as much as much distraction as you can She has some right aileron. Still needs more right aileron. Yeah, she's flying a little bit better now. Take her up. Gear down. I know I'm up awfully high. Make a pass right at us, right at the camera, right at me. There we go. All right. Take it out here. Time remaining, two minutes. All right. Start killing my airspeed. Kill my airspeed a little bit. Making my final approach. Level wings, level wings. And there we go. Oh yeah. Braking. I forgot I got brakes. Brake off. I don't know why. I didn't see anything in the advertisement about having brakes, but it does. It has reverse thrust. All right, here we go. I'm also featuring the uh, RC Geeks nozzles in there. That gives you a little extra power. Just a beautiful plane, absolutely beautiful plane. She needed a lot of right aileron right out of the box. But you know, you could have a plane on the bench Time remaining. One. and everything visibly looks trim, but once you get her in the air, it can be totally different. Remember, throttle management is everything. Oh. I should have kind of let hold that let that hold off for a little bit longer. I wouldn't have so much of a bounce. All right. One more time. When she takes off, she takes off in a quick. She takes off quick. Second. Gear down. All right, gear is down. 20 seconds. That's about all that was. 
All right. I don't want to hit that divot. That divot there has claimed more sets of my retracts than I care to admit. All right, let's check and see how much juice we have left in the tank. And I know you're saying, well, put a telemetry ESC in there and you can tell on your transmitter. Nope, I want to be old school. I want to see the battery. I want to feel the battery. I don't want to trust what my computer is telling me. I want to know for myself. That's just me though. Battery is quite warm, quite warm. So older battery though. Yeah, 27%. So we flew for three minutes and 28 seconds. Three and a half minute timer is all you need. And uh, that's it. Other, buy yourself an extension because the uh, EC5 ends right there, and that's a pain in the butt to get your uh, battery connected. But that was the maiden on this Rafal. I definitely call that a successful maiden, and that was a lot of fun. Folks, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hobby Zone, thank you for the first Rafal that I tore up and I replaced it with this one. Y'all have a good one. Don't forget, faith, family, and friends, and then Jets. Bye bye.